Hey everyone, my name is Jaden aka Baby J. For those who are new here and if you ain't new, you already know the deal. I'm back with another video this week. And today I will be doing my hair in these cute twists. So if you wanna learn more about me putting these twists in my hair, make sure to stay tuned. Make sure you like, comment, and hit that subscribe button and let's get right into the video. Cause girl, look at the parts. <laughs> What movie I'm watching? Shrek. My parts came out pretty nice. Make sure y'all praying for me that I don't have to go to the store.
Okay, y'all, so I'm done now. It's the next day. I'm gonna tell you guys a quick little couple of things about this hair. First of all, I got the Lulu Tris crochet hair. This is what the packaging looks like. I got 18 inches. Um, originally, I was gonna cut my hair. Originally, I was gonna do a short twist video. So on each of my twists, I actually have rubber bands. <laughs> on where I was gonna cut them at because I was gonna cut them but <laughs> y'all I like the lid so much I don't want to cut it so I'm not going to <laughs> but this process didn't take that long honestly if you are somebody that don't like to pay other people to do their hair this hairstyle is so easy to do and just so quick like it didn't take me as long as I thought it would it took me around two days and that's only because I was lollygagging on it like I could have done this a little bit faster if I had just you know sat down and stayed still and just did my hair but I was moving around and stuff too so that's probably why it took me so long but um also I learned a new trick while I was watching other people do this hairstyle and they basically would put they basically would put jam they would part their hair and then they would put jam on the part that they made and then after that they would go back over the part with the rat tooth comb and basically um, make the part straighter and that has made my part so straight so I recommend everybody doing that if you want your parts to be straight if you don't care about your parts you don't need to do that but if you like your parts to be straight do that um, basically how I did this hairstyle is that mirror back there I had it behind me so I could see the back of my head um, I have a mirror right here and then I also have a mirror right here, like underneath me right here. There's a mirror back there. And then I have one more mirror. So I had a whole bunch of mirrors so I could see from each angle that I need to see from. So that's basically how I did the back of my head. Also, originally I was going to do the crochet method, but I ended up doing my little rubber bands a little bit too tight and I didn't want to stick this through that. So I will end up doing a tutorial using the crochet method. I will link two videos with two different methods that I thought were pretty cool. So I'll link those down in my description box below if you guys want to check out how other people put in their twists as well I know a lot of people don't like when they start with braids and then you become twists but I feel like this is the most beginner friendly way to do it if you are just now starting to do your own hair this is the best way to do it because everybody knows how to do a little three braid you know and then after that you just twist and if I could do this you could do it too I promise you if I can do my own hair you could do your own hair anyways y'all I want to thank you guys for watching today and I hope you guys enjoyed my video make sure you give me a like comment and hit that subscribe button because it helps me out and I just want to say nobody can do you better than you can do you so continue to do you I'll see you guys in my next video